and there are NDPs, I think, that are concerned. Just, I think, a couple of days ago on CBC Radio, the former NDP finance minister, uh, Janice McKinnon, said, and said this, and I quote, if you start to add up, there is a lot of spending here. She's talking about the NDP promises. If you start to add up, there's a lot of spending here. And how do you reconcile that with the idea of a balanced budget? She goes on to say there are positions being taken that are not consistent with what past NDP governments have done. That's the former finance minister in the Romano administration. I think the Romano NDP were a little bit different than Mr. Lingenfelter and the current spend DP. I mean NDP. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a couple days we'll present our platform. Here's what you can expect. You can expect uh, what you've already heard from us and what Laura's been campaigning on. You can expect targeted and focused relief on affordability issues for seniors and for students and for families. You can expect some innovative ideas to improve uh, rural health care. You can expect a vision for a growing Saskatchewan that's founded on fiscal responsibility and balanced budgets. You can expect a fully costed platform uh, and the numbers in that platform, by the way, will not have changed from the day that we announced those ideas uh, earlier on in this campaign. You can expect consistency, a vision of growth that's worthy of this province, and you, will, you can also expect responsibility. Because that's what you have asked of us. That's what the people of the province expect of their government. I don't think their votes are for sale. I think they're going to make a very clear and definite choice to move this province forward with a responsible plan and a vision that is worthy of the Saskatchewan that you have built. Thanks for coming.